Hey guys, Bill Schimantel, Derek Stewart, Tim Tuttle, Heller High Water, BBZ TV. We're going to do something new today. Um, we're going to take a trip out of Santa Barbara Island. We've never been there before. Uh, we got our radar set up. We're going to pick up some bait and we're just going to do an exploratory mission. Exploratory? Yeah. Uh, is that like exploratory? Or yeah. yeah, something like that. Four in the morning. Exploratory, yeah. exploratory Tim. Hey, when you wake up at 2 o'clock in the morning. Explore, Derek. <laughs> you wake up at 2 in the morning. Explore, Bill. See the crap I'm getting already? So it should be a good trip. Just beginning. The, the, the slams are coming. So, uh, oh, oh, horn works. So Tim's still trying to figure out his own boat. <laughs> Jackass. <laughs> so uh, enjoy us. Uh, <laughs> join us. Join us to uh, have a little trip out to Santa Barbara Island. Let's see what it's all about. And uh, let's walk you through what we're doing today. And hopefully we catch some fish. Night lines. Yeah. Jackasses. <laughs> jackasses. Jackasses. <laughs> Big jackass. So, hold on. Okay guys, took us about an hour and 40 minutes, made a run over here to uh, Santa Barbara Island. You see in the background, we saw a big piece of kelp, we're just going to check it out and uh, we're going to probably use a little bit of everything and just see if we can figure out uh, where the fish are and what they want to eat. So we're going to throw some plastic on this and maybe drop a bait on it and then we're going to go on the island and start trolling around and graphing and see if we can find some yellowtail or white sea bass. Okay, we got some good bait in here. Good bait. Are you setting up your uh, live bait? With? Just using my uh, Daiwa rod and reel setup. 65 pound braid on this one. I did a 25 pound test top shot of fluorocarbon and fly lined right to a uh, 3 aught Gamagatsu ringed, ringed hook. And I'm going to nose hook a sardine when we get into the, the area. come up here it still looks like some kelp a lot of broken up kelp until I find something decent those look I don't know what those are nothing real big you want to troll until then yeah let's uh let's put your one of each out there oh, put the BBZ out there Bill? yeah yeah I'm gonna throw the BBZ out oh, and then I'm... oh go ahead throw it out man hold on to... <laughs> Eric's on. Double, 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 double boiling trouble, brothers. BBZ double header. Okay, you guys get ready. I'm going to put you in reverse real slow. Oh. Keep rolling, Derek. He's coming toward you. You got, you got seals all over you guys, so. What do you got, Derek? Derek, right here. Derek, right here. I'm already up. Okay, hold on. I want to get net for you, Derek. Derek's got a jack. We'll see if we can get him in and out real quick. Yep. Hold on one second, Tim, brother. You're clear. Double, double, right on the outside of those big bait balls, man. Man, that six inch BBZ is some some serious crap right there. Lighten it up. Woo. Okay, that's down. That fucker's stronger oh. than shit. You might be able to get that hook right there off that net. Pull them out. Okay. And that's clear. Man, those are solid. Throw that one back. You don't want that one, right, Tim? That does look interesting up here, though, with all this pile of birds right in front of us. 
Oh, I think we're we're getting close to something happening, guys. There's a bunch of birds starting to crowl up. That means there's probably bait or something there. I think we're uh, getting ready to make something happen. Keep, oh, got hit, got hit, got hit, right there. Got hit, guys, got hit. Put it out of the gear. Take it out of the gear. I'm trolling the BBZ. What is that? Oh, the seal got him. Shit. Dang, seal got him. That's gonna be fun. I almost thought, I was like, what the heck? Yeah, seals, seals got him. See if he let go, let's just see. Come on, seal, get off of there. Take your chunk and leave him. Take your chunk and leave him. Let's see what we had on. We had... Yellowtail. No. Barracuda? No. No. Uh, tuna. Had a small tuna on. That was a tuna. Son of a bitcha. Let's get a... Small, small tuna. He's a little... <laughs> you try to mess with me. You try to... You dirty... Fishes. You dirty dog. Grabbing my line trying to make me think I'm bit. You bastard. You know, you give a guy a heart attack doing that crap, you know? Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. How do you know, Tim? <laughs> Only because he's done it to me 20,000 times. No, I have not. Maybe two. That looks like the real kind there. What on, what on, Derek? BBZ six inch mackerel. BBZ six inch mackerel. It's okay, we. No, we're good. He's got. I'm, all, I'm watching his line. He's got a lot of line on it. Artificial BBZ, baby. I know, I'm watching. If we get down to half, I'm gonna, I'm bringing mine in and get this out of the way. BBZ six inch. 65 pound braid? Yes. Okay. Okay, seal popped up right behind you. Oh, friggin' seal got you again? Nope, no, I just said it. it popped up right behind him. See it? Yep. yep. Oh no. Oh no. I think he already took the yep. out of it. It just got lighter. What did we have there, buddy? That's a good fish he's throwing around back there. Let's yep. see that, man. Wow. Okay, let's get back out. Well, I'm gonna try to troll again, the little six inch BBZ. Get that thing behind the boat back there. Put it in gear. Get going about uh, five to six miles per hour. That's what I was doing. And I'm gonna actually do a little loop around here a big wide loop to get back across those birds let out a good quarter of a spool Maybe a little bit more always cool to hold the rod when you get one to just crack that thing. right at the birds and work it there's some fish breaking right here I don't know what they are seagulls just came up and uh, we're whacking at them they're right right where Tim's at Derek's on, BBZ, <laughs> BBZ. Bird, that's a bird bitch. Nice. There you go, good catch and release right there. I'll tell you what though, those Gamagatsu short shank EWGs on these, man, they stick fish. They do. They, Nothing's getting off. They, they stick them, man. Nothing's getting off unless something chews the other end of it. Yeah, it's amazing how those seals could rip the head head off. Just chew that head off and have the body by themselves, and just take everything off. The just head. whacked, and my flat lined it. Are you on still? Nope. Okay, he just hit mine too. Just, just. Are you still on? No. Leave him out. Just thumped the crap out of it. Turn back right around there, Timmy. Let's go back and cl clobbered it. The same spot. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we felt I felt something hiccup my line first, and then all of a sudden, Derek said he had his hiccup it, and then all of a sudden it just, I just got, just thumped. Oh, just got one, one just whacked the crap out of it again. You guys want to stop here and throw around a little bit? Sure, why not? Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <sighs> There's a seal back there too. Come on. Come on. 
I don't know if the seal got it or not. Keep going, Timmy. Keep going. You know what? When you can't make bait and make start or mackerel, holy shit, this thing's kicking my ass. Whoo! You're out of gas. Oh my gosh, that's my biggest yellow right there. That is a big... Here, turn it sideways. Up, up straight down like that this. Big, that's my biggest. Okay, that's my biggest yellow tail on the six inch BBZ. Oh my god, I, I can't even. I can't move my arms, fucking toast. Oh, got him on the wind. Stopped trolling and started winding. And it just stopped it like a freight train. Okay, now, holy crap. Dude, this, this is a toad, man. Dude, this thing's... Hey, guys. <laughs> That's my biggest yellowtail, six-inch BBZ. <laughs> Timmy's going to hold them up for me. <laughs> oh, look at that beast. How's that for a toad? Okay. Okay, we're going to, uh, I'm going to take some photos, but I'll take some pictures, buddy. We might not let this one go. No. Hey guys, <laughs> I'm gonna wipe my face on that one. Whoo! Okay, yellowtail, kick ass. Um, we put that one in the box. It was 30 pounds. So, set up, guys. We did the uh, Lexa 400 Maxima yellow braid, 65 pound test. We did a top shot of 50 pound ultra green mono and my favorite little bait the spro bbz six inch and this is the custom weighted one you'll see that on my uh, youtube channels on how to do a custom weighted one that's the spro prime snap and that's the 125 mile model good teamwork uh and then our fourth pass we end up getting that big ass uh yellowtail my uh, biggest so far so we're gonna do uh, another troll in the... Hey guys, we had a uh, fun trip out here to uh, Santa Barbara Island. Derek, Stuart, Tim Tuttle, and myself. And uh, it wasn't a wide open bite. You expect if you go uh, you know, far away from standard places that you could just lay into them. But uh, it's still fishing, it's tough. You gotta really uh, tear apart the water, look for the bait fish, the birds. We came out here, we had a whole live well full of really really nice sardines and every time we pin one on you'd throw it out there and within five seconds a seal would eat it and chew it up so the more we threw live bait the more we had seals around our boat we couldn't even get a, a bait out there so we started using artificial um, and then we just decided to troll 
we were looking for mackerel to a sabiki rig. We didn't find any mackerel to sabiki rig. Guess what? Spro BBZ1 six inch mackerel, custom weighted, put them on. We ended up catching uh, five little tunas, um, probably what, five to eight pounds? Yeah. You know, five to eight pounds. The seals got two or three of them. Um, actually, the seals got two of them, and then we got the last three. And uh, they just they just clobbered the six inch. And then uh, on a long troll, we stopped. I took it out of gear, and uh, that was the big uh, yellowtail. I was just hand winding it in, and it ate on the on the retrieve. And that one went 30. So um, it was a good day. We we caught some fish. We didn't catch the fish we wanted because we all wanted to catch a ton of big yellowtail or white sea bass. But just remember, if you don't have mackerel and they're eating it. That's what the uh, six inch BBZ1 was made for. It represents a mackerel and a sardine and a six inch. And the fish eat it. It is a phenomenal bait. So make sure you guys check out Tackle Warehouse or any place that uh, carries them. They have them all over the place. But uh, Or check my website and uh, pick some up. And if you come out here to the islands or just out the ocean and you want to throw them around, you will get bit on them. So hope you guys enjoy this. Take care. We're going to have about a two and a half hour run back to home base. And uh, we'll catch you next time out on the water.